You know, each and every week here on Monday Night Raw, we make history. Each and every week, we have tremendous action. But I believe this week is looking like one of those legendary episodes we'll never, ever forget. There will be moments created that will live forever in the annals of history. And we are just moments away from kicking off one of the biggest Raws ever. Chances here tonight. I love them. I'm not like everybody else, Cole. It seems like everybody's ready to write the champ's demise, but not me. superstars in the women's division. We've seen some unlikely teams pair up just for a shot at these tag titles. That's what it means to many of the women's rivals. Nicely done with the head scissors. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Oh, on the eight. Recovered by the champ. Bam, suplex. Just looking for ways to wear out her opponent. Luster behind that kick. Byron, how does this matchup require a different mindset? A superstar must be prepared to go all out. Be as aggressive and vicious as possible. Remember, it's no disqualification. The superstars can do whatever they want, but it can only end with a three count or a tap out. Hard forearm shot, and there's more. My goodness. Shayna looking to loosen the grip of her opponent. Yeah, Ripley's high impact offense has Baszler off balance. Oh, what a kick! And Baszler had it scouted. Boom! Head kick connects. <laughs> Baszler dodges it. Bopping at the leg. Turn Nia Jax around there. Back in under the ropes. Cross the top rope all the way 
right to the floor. Taking this to the floor. She's about to rise up to something catastrophic. Straight impact on the throat. Able to reverse. Deep arm drag. She's fighting back. A ridiculous standing shooting star. The challenger not looking good. Here's the pin. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. Clearly, she's still got a lot of fight left in her. And it looks like she wants to take this match outside. She's getting something from under the ring. Oh, man. Ladies and gentlemen, battle. Strong foot. My goodness. Except to tap out here. She's gonna have to. No, she, she breaks it. Big escape there. Oh. And the champion finally ready to put this one away. She just dug down deep there. But I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. And the damage is just going to keep on coming if you can't find the defense for this. And things are just going from bad to worse. And they failed to hit the mark. Oh, my God. Basil turns it around. Jax with great career with that. Impressive assault from Rhea Ripley. And Ripley is in complete control. Now Nia looking for some momentum. Jax being like... That stretch could... Position looking to crowd to grip the part. And they do. I gotta say, the amount of punishment we've seen in the match would have already ended most superstars. The level of resilience we're seeing is off the charts. Fishing for something beneath the ring. We are looking to end this one right now. This will do it. The prison trap is in. Look at the power of the nightmare. puts it Cole, the alpha male of our species has arrived. The following contest is an eight man battle royal making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar! The most decorated combat athlete in history. Brock Lesnar is hazardous to your health. Since he 
debuted here at WWE. And I have never been as frightened as I am when Brock Lesnar enters an arena. Brock Lesnar doesn't respect anyone in WWE or walking the planet Earth, nor should he have to. You're looking at the Beast Incarnate. The Prince has arrived. A decorated champion who has truly reinvented himself. And from Gray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Big The first ever Universal Champion, a multiple time Intercontinental Champion, NXT titles, what can't the Prince do? Well, it seems like year after year, Finn Balor just reaches greater heights in his career. One of the 
tallest competitors in WWE history. The personification of intimidation. The Colossus has arrived. And from Lagos, Nigeria, weighing in at 400 pounds, Uma! Well, he's formerly AJ Styles' personal Colossus, but now he fights for himself. Yeah, now that Omos can do whatever he wants, he basically puts every superstar in the WWE locker room on notice. A mean streak a mile high. I don't think there's anybody in WWE who can stop Omos. over the entire locker room, both literally and figuratively. Who in the world can take down this Colossus known as Omas? For Bobby Lashley, business is always good. And from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, the almighty Bobby Lashley. A truly astounding physical specimen, military trained, countless amateur accolades, and a dominant MMA career. to Lashley earlier today. He said tonight he's in a bad mood and he might not let go of the hurt lock. Who's gonna make him stop? Give it a shot, Saxton. I'm good. Look at the physique. From Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, Sammy Zayn! Well, the conspiracy theorist himself has now joined us. Although, you should be excited about that, Byron. One of the greatest minds this industry has ever known. Conspiracy or otherwise, Sami Zayn has never been more successful than he has recently. Well, certainly uh, no one can question the in-ring ability of Sami Zayn, a multiple-time intercontinental champion. Somehow, for some reason, Sami Zayn still can't get a fair shake here in WWE. Yeah, sure he can. People seem to forget how beloved Sami Zayn was. Now all anybody wants to do is complain about him. Well, it's because Sami's changed. Sami hasn't changed. The world around him has.
he wants. McIntyre laser focused. This highly anticipated battle royal has begun. A very unpredictable kind of match. Chaos reigns supreme. Even the most seasoned superstar can fall victim to the numbers game. Or an unexpected elimination. Ricochet. He has been eliminated. The strategy here is to be prepared for anything. Oh. A possible elimination in progress. Oh. Uncorked a big punch. He went right into that turbo. Giving up on that elimination. You gotta spend your energy wisely in this match. Oh, right to the throat. Shot punch. Forced out of the ring. Finn Balor has been eliminated.
The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Hey. Face first. The face of Brock Lesnar looks like it's been through a wood chipper. him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Uh, enough already. He's reeling, slowly getting up. Absolute buzzsaw of a competitor, and she's only gotten more dangerous since her streak ended. 
And on the other side of the ring is Lana, a superstar who has overcome more than her fair share of challenges. People say she doesn't belong, but that has only fueled Lana to work twice as hard to prove the wrong. Lana never hesitates to take on new obstacles. The problem is, those obstacles usually knock her down with destructive force. Koryoski is such a dominant competitor, it's hard to find flaws, but what do you think is her from the middle rope? Oh, a splash! Looking to take flight here. From the top! Takes another trip to the skies, and it pays off once again. Splash! Got a helter-skelter out of cover. Shoulders are down. Unbelievable that she kicked out at all. Really just laying it in. And now Lana's being measured. Now this one's all but over. It's locked in. We could see a table. It's locked in. I'm not sure there's anything she can do here. Looks like she has other plans here. I think she was just looking at shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for her. Broke a sweat. We all wanna go big. Big match up here tonight, ready to go. And oh, look at from behind. Why did he come out here and ruin this thing? It's a message sent. A message that needed to be sent. Yeah, that guy should be suspended or fined. This is ridiculous. You're crazy. He's just doing what he needed to do. And how could he even go in this match? Oh, come on. He's not ready. It seems like even when Kevin Owens isn't in the ring to host a segment of his talk show, he still transforms any stage he is on into the KO show. And Kevin Owens creates must-see moments wherever he goes. His unique energy and his connection with the people of the WWE Universe ensures that he's got everyone's eyes and ears at all times. He certainly is a captivating performer who's going to try to run the show in this match. And then you have Big E, primed and ready to show out here tonight. Look at the focus in his eyes. Listen, I've been critical of Big E for putting too much emphasis on having fun and doing whatever it is that he does with his hips. I believe it's hindered the trajectory of his career. But looking at Big E... Uh-oh, second row. Are you kidding me? Wow! Guys, that might have been the best moonsault ever. Uh, big height on that moonsault. This could be it. Cover! One, two, Big E digging deep for the kick out. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. battle-tested superstar with plenty of in-ring experience, but what's it going to take for him to get the win here? We know from KO's past matches that when the time calls for it, he's capable of some truly brutal attacks. I think this match is one of those times. Owens needs to let loose and give this thing his all if he wants to come on top. The people came to see the KO show, and they're getting it. Just look at KO taking control here. This is what it's going to take for KO to win this thing. Letting loose with some brutal offense. The U-turn Big E needed in this match could have been right there. Big forearm. Oh, Big E avoids contact. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Shot after shot after shot. Ooh, we got a cover. Able to stop the pin count here. Now oh, trampling the opposition. And now Big E is under immense pressure. Yeah, Big E needs to fight. Take it over. Go for the win here. He's on the ropes. The official sees it and waves off the pin. Zentai hits the target. He's going for the pin. This could be it. And a strong 
kick out in one. Somehow still has the energy for a quick kick out. Finds the advantage after a straight cut. This couldn't do it. He gets the kick out after the one. But that won't beat him. I'm not sure anything will. for the kill shot one more time. Oh, incredible elevation from the big man. We got a rope break. And he has an answer for Big E. Multiple stops. Here he goes for the win. And he closes it out. He's on the ropes to the ref. Wiser stops the count. Goes crashing down. Sizing him up, getting ready. Oh, he's looking for the top. Powerball. KO about to sew this up. One, two, three. And victory. Here is your winner, Kevin Owens. No other way to put it, guys. That was kind of a butt kicking. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation. since joining NXT and amazingly lost practically no speed. Indeed, an intense grappler who lives by the creed, the mat is sacred. He's ready to impose Imperium's will here 
tonight. You know, I read on social media that Eichner's the second Italian-born WWE superstar since Bruno Sarantino. Damian Priest and the Archer of Infamy is a man of impressive agility and outright devastating offense. Calculating and cool, Damian Priest leans on his martial arts background, ensuring each move is forceful and consequential. Absolutely, Byron. And any opponent that ends up on the receiving end of Priest's offense will end up battered on the top. Oh, Good lord. Up to the top rope now. From the top. Took a gamble once, took a gamble again, and hit the jackpot twice. Up high. Beautiful dive. You've got to be kidding me. Using your body as a missile over and over to the sky. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. Oh, ouch. Damian Priest has an air of confidence when he enters each match. How do you expect him to back up that confidence tonight, Corey? Priest knows his way around the ring. When you combine that with his physical abilities, he makes for a punishing opponent. His experience is going to play a big part in his game plan tonight. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. And that could end up putting Eichner on shaky legs a bit. Yeah, an example of that forceful, devastating offense from Priest. of infamy hitting the bullseye and rarely is he off target priest knows what he needs to end this and eichner had it scouted with the reversal reversal after reversal these two are ready for each other To the midsection, hoisted up, disorienting spin and revolutions in the spinning power bomb. That could bring an end to Priest. He manages to kick out. What strength! Somehow, some way, escapes defeat. Still alive, and there needs to be a refocus now. That was the moment that could have ended things. A moment that's being replayed in their heads right now. He's starting to struggle here. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Uh-oh. Talk about dismantling your opponent. This could be it. Cover for the win. Good officiating there. Referee seeing him the ropes and breaking the count. Yeah. You're looking for a vertical suplex. Oh, my God, into a powerbomb. And there's that alarming offense from Eichner. Big boot! Incredible. Eichner's in a compromised position. Uh-oh. Priest has it on Dream Street. Right to the spine. And there's the cover! Here is your winner, Damian Priest. And in this match with a big win under his belt. No doubt about it, the better superstar definitely won tonight. The most lethal superstar in the history of WWE, the Apex Predator, the Viper, is here. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall.
Introducing first, representing R.K. Bros. from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, The Viper. Legendary factions that Randy Orton has been a part of. All steps in his career greatness. He right, learned from the best, but at a very early age, Randy proved he could go it alone. Yeah, we learned very quickly that Randy Orton was the student who was able to surpass the Masters. And in the process, Randy Orton has become a master in his own right. One of the most vindictive, one of the most vengeful, and one of the most dangerous superstars you will ever see. That's why I love everything about this guy, Saxton. Such an impressive array of in-ring skills possessed by the Viper. Already Orton needs is one RKO to end your evening. Well, Byron, I guarantee you Orton's gonna show us tonight that he's much more than that. Yeah, Randy Orton is an SOB. we're going to see and riddle then across from them we see montez ford and angelo dawkins these teams have scouted each other very well they probably identified the weak link in their opposition likely going to want to isolate and punish that single individual solid contact from the viper boom was mounted with punches and not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Strikes with a kick. Counter 
counters the Viper's attack. put on the defensive. Agonizing. Position. Hangman's DDT. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. From the top. Are you kidding me? Tagged into action. Yeah. Flipping same time. Oh, oh, oh. And Ford had it scouted. Riddle out of the way. Crashing down with the centaur. This match is brutality starting to show on him. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Here he comes off the tag. Yeah. Oh, man! Oh, my gosh, what impact! Ooh, treading all the way to their opponent. Oh, test for a second. Sure, that was it. How many times have we seen Orton punish his opponent? Montez is in a very vulnerable position here. Saw it coming and got out of there. And the cover for the win! This is it! A defiant kick out after one. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Answers back on Orton. Muscling up their opponent into the gut wrench. Ooh. Whoa, drop kick all the way to the outside. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Team to victory tonight. Two men with one common goal can be a dangerous thing. They're putting the entire locker room on notice.
weighing in at 175 pounds, Ray Mysterio! A true favorite of the WWE Universe has never strayed from their adulation. This man is invincible. Dragunov's a man who struggles to keep his rage in check, but when Dragunov loses it, let's be honest, it's a lot of fun to watch. And his opponent from Moscow, Russia, weighing in at 187 pounds, Ilya Dragunov. He ended Walter's 870-day-long title reign. A seemingly impossible task made possible by focusing the rage within himself. Ilya Dragunov is a dangerous man. Dragunov looking to expand his power to all of WWE. Now, this is a very interesting superstar, Ilya Dragunov, the so-called Mad Russian, who first made his name in NXT UK. Interesting is one word for it. Dragunov is basically a living embodiment of intensity. He subscribes to the philosophy of Unbi Ziegbar, which basically means once he gets going, he considers himself invincible. That philosophy definitely makes him a formidable opponent. The key is, can Dragunov control that intensity and maintain it for the duration of the match? And he's facing off against Rey Mysterio, a competitor who is known to bring the fight with a lot of heart. You find out real quick that Rey is tough to keep down. Mysterio shows no fear and has a larger shadow than his stature would determine. But there are a lot of people in the locker room who want to be the one to say, I brought down the biggest little man in WWE. From the top, double stop! Dragunov is out of the way. Dragunov has said to himself, and I quote, I am violence, and he considers himself to be invincible. How do you account for a man like that? Well, if anything, he's too intense. Dragunov puts too much emotion out there, and sometimes that rage gets the better of him. When he goes fully off the handle, that's your opening to exploit his mistakes. But it's going to hurt to get to that point, so be ready. And that holds Dragunov back. Spin kick to the midsection. He is just reeling from that offense. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Oh, foot just stomping down. Oh, bruising up 
offense from Mysterio. Dragunov let his rage get the better of him, and we're seeing his opponent exploit that. Well, she's scary, all right. The queen of the Scots. And the best high flyer in the women's division. Oh, some will say that. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Glasgow, Scotland, Kaylee Ray. I cannot believe that this woman was actually NXT UK Women's Champion for 649 days. That's ridiculous. Oh, yeah, better believe it, Mike. In fact, Kaylee Ray has referred to herself as the, quote, forever champion. That's pretty incredible. It is incredible. Well, forever could all come to a screeching halt tonight. Extremely arrogant and very disrespectful. I saw how this woman was talking to you, Byron. Well, thanks for standing up for me, Mike. Well, no, I actually liked it. There's a reason she's one of NXT UK's most successful competitors. The man is here! Becky Lynch never backs down from a fight and as a result has earned everyone's respect. From Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch! From underdog to the top of the food chain, Becky Lynch is ready for a fight and ready to put everyone on notice. It is amazing in such a short period of time, Becky Lynch has become one of the most popular superstars in WWE. Becky Lynch has never met a fight she didn't like. She's told the locker room to bring their A game. But standing across the ring is Kaylee Ray, a woman you do not want to underestimate. The scary queen of Scots has accolades worth taking notice of. Kaylee Ray becoming a household name and a force to be reckoned with. Record setting championship reigns, victories upon victories. She literally ran out of opponents at one point. She's that good. A oh, costly error there. Still a quick kick out at this point. There's press and added damage. And Lynch here. Corey, what do you think Becky has her mindset on doing in this match? Well, we all know Becky has an affinity for taking people's arms, and I don't see why she'll have any change of heart tonight. with a great shot. Connecting with a sharp elbow. Timely reversal on Lynch. Uh-oh. Look out. That looked effective. And Kaylee Ray just got torn down there. Yeah, Becky is now not messing around. 
showing she's always bringing that A game every night. <laughs> Trying to chop her down with a low kick. There's the crucifix, nicely done. <laughs> Boom. She's taking things to ringside. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? She heads out, but this one can be lost by countout. Hey. Hey. Oh. Well placed kick. Uh. Oh, submission. Just. Oh, look at this power. Incredible power from the position she was in. Lynch on the move. Not finished yet. How about another? She's showing signs of slowing now. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. And now she's looking to go top of From the top. Yeah. Oh, drop. Oh, a piercing elbow. Attempting high risk move after high risk move at a breakneck pace. Pitch me. I, I gotta be dreaming. There's no way she's still in this match. Kaylee wards that attack off. She's tipping the scales here a bit. And misses on the springboard. All right, now she's looking to apply the pressure with this submission maneuver. Just wrenching away. Think about all the pain she's in. And for some reason, she lets go of the holes. Could have just got the shoulders down. Every kick out taking so much energy to muster. How about another? Producing a trampling. And Becky now getting in position. Becky Lynch rolls through and she's got the disarmor. And she releases the hold as she feels that enough for the win. One, two. Oh, somehow managed to keep this match going. Can somebody tell me what it's going to take to put her away? for maybe the emergency room or the locker room. This is gonna be bad. Look at this, she releases the hold. That's a little surprising, no? From the pin, and the win! Yes! One, two, three! Man, that was a hard-fought win. She's gotta be proud of herself tonight. Here is your winner, Becky Lynch! She earns the W against fierce competition. She came into this match with one thing on her mind. And would you look at that? It came to fruition.
The following contest is a fatal four-way tag team match. Introducing first, at a combined weight of 371 pounds. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. teams facing off in this tornado tag match. In a tornado tag situation, you never know how many opponents will be targeting you. Remember you on your side.
slam. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Trying again. Elusive. 